everybody and welcome back to Happy Blonde. But before we start this video, can I get just five seconds of Happy 2018? I told you all I get really, really excited over New Year's in my previous video. If you haven't seen it, please go check it out when you finish this one. But yeah, I just wanted 2017 to be over and now that 2018 is finally here, I have so many, many things planned for this channel and that is the reason for this video, to keep you all posted and give you updates of what I want to do for this 2018. And before we start, leave on the comment section down below what are some of your New Year's resolutions. I mean, dreams, bucket list goals, anything that you want to do for this year, leave it on the comment section down below. I'd love to hear from all of you, so let's get started with the updates. So the first update that I want to do for this year, you've probably seen it by now, probably not. That all depends on the internet, because, hey, I still got no power here. So yeah, that all depends if I actually... So yeah, that all depends if I actually got good internet to upload what I want, but the channel is getting an entire new look that means new channel art, new profile picture. I don't know if I'm going to change the logo. I'm still kind of picky about that because it's still a new logo. So the logo, it's still on hold, but definitely we are getting a new intro for this 2018. Going on to the second update, in terms of my choreographies and dances, I am still working on getting partners for duets. So if you are a male Puerto Rican dancer who is interested in collaborating with me, please leave it on the comment section down below i beg you i have so many many duets planned and i am already working with some people but it's very hard when they work you work you study they study schedules are a hassle and in terms of my individual choreographies i definitely have a lot of those planned i am planning like instead of a throwback thursday a throwback month where we just upload choreographies of different musics that have been incredibly amazing throughout the ages and they are oldies but goodies so there's gonna be that as well and yeah my choreographies are gonna get more difficult probably shorter probably longer it all depends I am definitely planning more collaborations with other people and if you want to collaborate with me and have a special idea Again, leave it on the comment section down below, contact me. I always post my social media at the end of the videos, so feel free to message me. I love hearing about you guys and your feedback and what you like, what you like to see, what you want to do. So, yeah. In terms of my third update, I'm definitely going to start doing short films this year. I am so, so excited to start producing my own content. I mean, I'm a film student, it's what I want to do with my life, so I've talked to some members of my crew and I've already talked to some people and I am definitely going to start doing my own short films this year. So I will be opening up casting very, very soon. So if you are Puerto Rican and you want to star in one of my short films, please let me know and email me to this email right here. Send me your resume, your headshot, and a small clip of you doing a scene, a monologue, or I don't know, literally just talking about yourself. Sometimes it's even amazing how you can know if somebody is a genuine actor when they talk about something that they are very passionate about or something that they deeply loathe. I don't know, it's just something that somebody told me a long time ago and that kind of stuck to me. Going on to the fourth update and a little story time. It's been on my mind for the last couple of days to take cosmetology courses and then get the license. Partly because it helps in terms of production design when I go into the film industry. And the other part of me sincerely and genuinely just loves makeup. I love buying makeup, I love doing my makeup, except when I have to do it every day. Because I get very, very lazy. I love watching makeup reviews, I mean, Jeffree Star, Manny Mua, Nikki Tutorials, those guys are incredibly amazing and I just love seeing how they definitely create art. And when I bit the NYX review and I gave it my own twist, it was incredible to mix dancing with film and makeup as well. And if you haven't seen the NYX review, I won't even say it. You guys know what to do. So yeah, if you liked the NYX review and you liked the twist I gave it, give this video a big thumbs up to let me know so I can continue doing videos like those for you guys. And 
And just like that, we have reached the end of this video. I want to give a huge thanks to all of my followers for all of your love and support. Ever since this channel started on June last year, it has grown little by little and I am definitely in love with the outcome. I had no idea creating this channel would become something so dear and personal for me and that wouldn't have been made possible if it wasn't for you guys. So again, thank you so so much and I love the fact that you're always so positive and spreading positive vibes. You guys like my videos, you comment on them, you subscribe, and you even sometimes message me personally saying, hey, I really liked this video, keep going, or you say, hey, I think that you can improve here and there, because I am definitely open to criticism. After all, criticism is what makes you grow as a person and professionally, so I am definitely open to that. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do so right now. I am going to leave right here the next video that I have been literally talking about this entire video and another choreography video right here. And I can't wait to hear from all of you about your feedback in terms of what we talked about. So yeah, please message me and I will see you guys next time. Bye!